Good afternoon, everybody! Well, I can't believe we're making this video today, but here to let you know, school will be canceled for the rest of the school year. We will no longer be returning to Kennedy until next year. It's crazy, but that's what was announced today. It is currently 2.30 in the afternoon, Friday, April 3rd. No April Fool's joke for you today, ladies and gentlemen. This is for real. So, some information for you here. I'll put a link uh, below so you can get to this as well. Uh, let's see here. When will schools close? Today, the Sacramento County Office of Education, SCOE, with the full support of the Sacramento County Public Health, announced closure period for schools will be extended through the end of our academic year on June 11th, 2020. It's crazy, crazy, but we will not be going back to Kennedy until next school year, ladies and gentlemen. All right, uh, what's the timeline for distance learning? Our plan is to begin district-wide formal distance learning on April 13th. The district looks forward to continuing our discussions with SCTA to continue developing and implementing our distance learning plan. While during this period of school closures, this would include setting expectations for distance learning, as well as responsibilities of other key non-classroom certificated employees, including counselors, social workers, nurses, school psychologists, training specialists, librarians, program specialists, resource teachers, and language, speech, and hearing specialists. Again, they remain hopeful that they can help. Basically, what that means is we're working on it, and we're going to figure it out by the 13th and let you know what we're going to do. Just the way it goes. We've talked about this before. Got to stay flexible at this time. Don't get too caught up on things, all right? Uh, let's see. Will the district be providing to students in need? On Friday, April 3rd, we will begin distributing computers to students at specific school locations. Uh, Kennedy was not one of those school locations today, but in the very near future, we will be a school location uh, distributing computers to students that need them. So, we're in good luck there. If you need a computer, be aware. I'll be updating you as I get that information to take care of you, all right? Uh, next up, do you have free student learning resources available during the closures? There's a lot of free stuff that's available for you. Take a look at all of it. The links are below. Don't worry about it. Um, schools will still be serving meals. There's about 31 schools in the district that are serving meals at this time, which is fantastic. So if you need that, it's there for you. Uh, now, the biggest question is, how will school closures affect the class of 2020? One day at a time, ladies and gentlemen, one day at a time. That's all we can do at this point in time, is just take one day at a time and figure out what we can do. Now, a couple things that have uh, adjusted or changed. University of California system has temporarily relaxed admission standards for both newly admitted students and prospective high school and community college students to account for changes in instruction methods, grading, and administration of standardized tests. So the universities have recognized that there is a significant challenge uh, for students at this time, and they are adjusting in order to make sure that you can still get into their universities. They're more than happy to get you in, and they're more than happy to take your tuition, so just be patient with them. They'll figure out how to get you there. Uh, let's see here. The Sac City Unified District Scholarship deadline has been extended to Friday, May 22nd. So if you're looking to uh, apply for a scholarship, that's all there. Again, ladies and gentlemen, I'll put a link below so that you can find all this information for yourself. But uh, that's today's information from Sac City. Lots of interesting things going on. I can't believe it, but we will not be back to campus until next school year. Holy bejeebers. Can't believe that that's what I'm telling you right now, but that's what it is. So ladies and gentlemen, I hope you're having a good day and I uh, hope you've got some great plans for spring break, which is next week. So take care of yourselves. I'll see you soon. I'm working on some new videos for you. I'm learning how to edit, learning how to do stuff uh, with videos and production. And I've got some sound equipment coming in to increase the quality of this because I know that these webcams sound terrible. And as a sound guy, i got to take care of you on sound. Uh, again... Like below, subscribe. We'll get you all the information you need coming from Sac City as I can. If you've got any questions, please post them below in the comments section. That helps me a bunch. All right, ladies and gentlemen, hope you're having a great day. Go Cougars!